So we'll start from this case. So this case is about a balance scorecard and it was asked in the exam, HSC exam of June uh, 2017. So let's first get the information here. So the required is explain why the balance scorecard approach to performance measurement is more useful to measure performance for the people's bank than a traditional approach using solely financial uh, performance measures. Okay. So this is just about the advantages of balance scorecard over the uh, ratio analysis or financial performance indicators. Okay. So this is a quite straightforward answer and it's a very theoretical answer here and you just have to use only few points okay few points like why balance scorecard would be a correct approach for uh, people's bank okay so just remember or recollect the advantages of balance scorecard and try to write uh, points which are like useful uh, balance scorecard how it is useful for people's bank okay so if you write it you will get the four marks just write like four advantages that's more than enough so the bigger discussion part of this question is using all the all of the information provided including the people bank's vision and values discuss the performance of the people's bank in 2006 okay use each of the four headings of the balance scorecard to structure your discussion okay so the marks is 16 marks is given so four headings are there so i think there will be like four headings and uh, four goals and uh, four uh, measures or something could be there okay so it would be like 4 into 4 16 points or something they want us to uh, explain or uh, answer so let's start from the case so we'll start from here the people's bank is uh, just one second i think if you want we'll zoom it The People's Bank is a bank based in the country of Nokri. It has a population of 65 branches. Sorry, it has a total of 65 branches across the country and also offers online banking, access to services via computer and telephone banking, access to computer service agents against, sorry, agents over the telephone to its customers. Recently, the People's Bank also began offering its customers a range of mobile banking services which can be accessed from customers smartphones and tablet computers okay so there's also like mobile banking division which has come up its customer base is made up of both private individuals and business customers the range of services it offers includes current account savings account credit cards business and personal loans mortgages loans for property purchase the people's bank's vision is to be the bank that gives back to its customers and their purpose is to help the people and businesses of Nokri to live better lives and achieve their ambitions. In order to achieve this, the bank's value values are stated as follows. Okay, So their main vision is to give back to customers. So it might be in terms of uh, serving them better or like uh, reaching more customers or uh, uh, or helping the customers and it also it also says that they want to give to make the people and business in the country to much become much more better i think that is like offering loans and services and helping them to achieve their ambitions okay so mostly it's like overall it seems to be uh, like reaching with more services okay and uh, it also it looks like a, at a point like csr okay corporate social responsibility also they seem to be having let's see their bank's values what they are standing for putting customers needs first which involves anticipating and understanding customers need and making products and services accessible to as many customers as possible the people's bank has recently invested heavily in it security to prevent fraud and also invested to make more services accessible to disabled and visually impaired okay so these are their values for which they are standing for next one is making business simple 
which involves identifying opportunities to simplify activities and communicating clearly and openly, making a difference to the communities they serve, which involves primarily helping the disadvantaged and new homemakers, sorry, new homeowners, but also supporting small and medium sized businesses and acting fairly and responsibly at all times. Okay, so their value seems to be like uh, quite lengthy. Let's see here. He extracts from the People's Bank's balance scorecard as shown below. So they have, they have. and things like that so first we'll see with this roc is a financial perspective have they achieved it the target was 12 percent okay and uh, have they achieved it the answer is no they have not achieved it and it's linked with which objective whether it's linked with the values or with uh, okay whether it's like linked with the values let's check they have not mentioned whether it is financial perspective they have not mentioned a lot even shareholder angle they have not explained a lot they have told everything only in terms of customers Okay, see this is not seem to be included anywhere. Has it been included here? Okay, see it is not linked with any of the objective. Okay, so it's not any neither linked with the values. Okay, or the vision. Okay, the vision or the values neither of it is linked. So let's go to the interest income. The company has made an interest income. Is this linked? We'll check. So interest income is also not linked with anything. But have they achieved their goal? Yes, they thought of having 
they thought of uh, having an interest income of 7 million but they got 7.5 so that seems to be great net interest interest margin so this also is not identified in any values or vision and uh, they wanted to make a net interest margin of 2.5 percent but they got only 2.4 percent so they have not achieved so amount of new lending to smes so are they so is it like mentioned anywhere yes you can see it here so it says and the new homeowners but also supporting small sme businesses okay so that is like linked with we'll put the number three for values we'll put it as number one two three and for uh, vision we'll just type vision uh, one or vision two like that we'll type okay so this is three have they achieved it answer is no they have not achieved it let's see from the customer perspective how things are working so number of first time home buyers given a mortgage by the people's bank so is it linked with any of it let's check so it is here making a difference to the communities they serve which primarily involves helping the disadvantaged and new homeowners okay so giving priority to homeowners is their values is part of the value have they achieved it the answer is yes they have given a lot of loan they have achieved this goal so the total number of complaints that has fallen okay that has fallen so have they achieved it again yes is it linked to any objective let's check okay so the third one is about giving new loans the second one is about simplifying the activities and so it's about understanding customers needs and making products so i think understanding customer needs if they understand it properly the number of complaints won't arise so we can link it to one okay so next one is number of talking cash points installed for the visually impaired so is it part of anything so yes you can see here and also invested to make more services accessible to disabled and visually impaired so that is one of their value so their first value that is their first value and their first value is it achieved yes it is achieved the target was 100 they have achieved 120 number of wheelchair ramps installed in branches so and he also invested more services accessible to disabled again it's the same uh, value and have they achieved it the answer is yes they have achieved it so let's see the internal business processes so number of processes within the people's bank re-engineered and simplified so simplifying is value number two have they achieved it yes they have achieved the process they have simplified the process so number of new services made available through mobile banking so mobile banking is all about accessibility so let's see and making new products accessible to as many customers as possible so uh, that seems to be like accessing through mobile not all people can do it so it is like helping more people to uh, access the bank network okay so that comes under value one and have they achieved so the answer is no they wanted to achieve they wanted five new services to be launched but they launched only two incidences of fraud on customers